Hi, my name is Paige, and today I'm going to teach you how to save your page as a custom template and how to access pages from previous yearbook projects. The first thing you'll want to do is complete the design you'd like to use for your custom template. You can use the variety of tools available in the designer to do so. Once you are happy with your design, the first thing you'll want to do is click Save. After the save is completed, you'll select the small arrow next to the Save button. Click that arrow and choose Save as Template. A Save as Template menu will appear for you. In the Save as Template section, you'll complete this form before saving your page as a template. There are a few different places we're going to fill out. The first one is Template Type. Standard template can be used for candid pages and club pages. If you're making a custom people page, you'll want to make sure to choose people page. Next, you'll have the choice of whether to save each page individually or saving the page as a spread. Next, you'll want to give your template a name. We'll call this one Colorful Circles. Once you completed filling out the form, hit Save as Template. After it's been successfully saved, you can close out of the menu. To access your pages, you can go to the Template button, then choose Custom Templates. Your custom template will be available in this library of all previously saved custom templates. Ours is going to appear at the bottom of our list since that is the newest one we saved. You'll see it has a spinning wheel, and once that spinning wheel is completed, it will give you a small preview of your template. And that is how you save a custom template. Next, I'll teach you how to access pages from previous yearbook projects. First, you'll want to go to Insert Items, Template. At the top of this section is a button called Other Book Pages. You'll click that button. Then, you'll select the yearbook you like to choose pages from. In this drop-down menu, it will show you all the yearbook's accounts that your login is currently associated with. For our example today, I'm going to choose another demo account. From here, you can see all the pages previously made in your yearbook project. Once you find the one you'd like to use, all you have to do is click the thumbnail, then click the page to load it. Once the template is loaded onto the page, you'll be able to edit and make changes similar to any other template you drop into your project. Thank you for joining me today on learning to save custom templates and accessing pages from previous yearbook projects.